So, uh, kind of an interesting song choice. Uh, <laughs> um, but that's kind of how I'm feeling lately. Um, there seems to be a lot of dividing going on among some who who call themselves Christian and in my opinion it shouldn't be that way using politics as a way to put each other in nice little boxes nice little groups to make it easier to handle other people that's in my opinion that's not just wrong that's gross that's just that's just really gross to say to someone I don't like the way you are now so I'm gonna put you in this nice little cute package so so I can deal with you a lot better you see that that's not what Christ did and that's not the way that it should be it shouldn't be about putting people in nice little packages so you can handle them a lot better it's being there for someone through whatever mess whatever crap they're in whatever crap they're dealing with and it's not even about trying to get them to say the prayer that shouldn't even enter into your mind when you're talking to someone um, that seems to be a big problem among um, some Christians and I used to be that way how when you talk to someone even if it's a friend even if you're just meeting somebody you know there seems to be this thing about you know the very first words out of your mouth are do you know Jesus and that just kind of you know <laughs> kind of puts the the brakes on any decent conversation that you could have because some Christians seem to feel that they need to rack up their points to get their numbers up you know that somehow it's a uh, a competition among each other and competing against themselves that's not what it's about at all it's about loving people where they are not where you want them to be um, that's one big thing that that really needs to change um, especially among those who who claim to be a Christian is love people where they are at that moment not where you want them to be another thing that really kind of bugs me is some churches kind of look at the way people look the way they're dressed the music they even listen to and they judge them not maybe it's not out loud maybe they don't confront them but inside their mind inside their heart they say well this person is just not a good person because you know he's uh, he's dressed in all black wearing you know sons of anarchy stuff you know he's got his biker boots on and yeah I just described myself but hey um, he listens to heavy music where you know the majority of the vocals are, you know, or whatever, <laughs> and um, he's not a good person, you know. Well, it's not our business to to say who's a good person, who isn't a good person. We're just people, and we need to just love each other, you know, and not try and convince people to change not try to force them to change just be there you know to talk to them um, to show people the love that we have sometimes just by being there not by you know breaking out you know the uh, the sales pitch 
the religious sales pitch that some groups have done. Um, Kurt Cameron. Um, <clears throat> sorry. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm calling him out. Um, it doesn't do any good, and I'm going to end it with this before I get real rambly. It doesn't do any good to tell someone how horrible they are, that they're a liar, they're a cheater, they're an adulterer, they're this, they're that, when that doesn't do any good. There's no love in that. There's no love in beating somebody up emotionally with your words when you feel like you're doing something good. You know, you're trying to get them to, you know, come to Jesus. That's not how you do it. That's manipulation. That's religious manipulation, straight up. I mean, we got to talk about this. It's time to kind of get this dealt with. That's manipulation. And we don't need to manipulate people. We need to love people. We need to be there for people. Be there for your friends. Be there for your loved ones. If someone's going through something, hey, reach out and say, hey, you doing all right? Is there anything I can do? I'm here to talk. I'm here to listen. I'm here to I'm here to let you rant, to to yell, to scream, to to go off on something or someone. I'm here. And I don't know. That's kind of how I'm feeling about stuff lately. Um, again, this is probably rambly, hardly made any sense, but it's kind of how my mind works. Um, thanks for listening. Appreciate it. And I'll, uh, see you later. Take care. And that's the end of my show. Donk. Donk.